You know what they say, knowledge is power, and today we are going all out Iron Man. We're asking the question, who and what exactly is private property? And we have CEO of private property, Simon Bray, with us in studio to answer all our questions. Simon, so good to have you in studio today. Yeah, great to be in. Yeah, so thank you're going to be a regular face every Friday on Express. Yes, so. yes. You'll be seeing a lot more of me. <laughs> Early mornings, got to love it. Yeah, for sure. So, Simon, I just wanted to ask you the question, first and foremost, for anyone who's never heard of private property before, what would you say in a nutshell is it all about? Private property is effectively a website that empowers ordinary people to make the right property decisions. We've got thousands of property listings from all over the country, so if it's new and it's on the market, it's on our website. Estate agents, developers, private sellers, banks, they all list their properties on the platform, uh, and uh, you can browse, find exactly what you're looking for, and uh, connect to the agent or the seller that's marketing it. Now, I know I use it personally in my own life, and it's become such a popular website. Why do you think that is exactly? Well, I think, you know, we were blessed to be the first website of this kind in the country. So I think we've just built a great uh, uh, consumer base that understand and know our brand. Over that period of time, uh, we've developed, we've added innovative tools, we've added, uh, you know, great uh, web offerings that make it convenient to sit on your couch at home and browse for your next property. Uh, and with more and more people going online to look for property, uh, it's just become an indispensable service to a lot of people. I think the thing about convenience is the most important thing. People don't want to be bogged down with too many things that they don't understand. But what about somebody looking to buy or sell property? What can they expect from the website? Well, buyers can obviously expect you know, a wide selection of properties. Mm -hmm. So if you're looking for a flat or a townhouse or a, a beautiful home with a garden, you're going to find it on private property. Sellers, you can expect to market to a huge audience. I mean, you've got more than a million people on the site every month, uh, and they spend time looking for their next home. Uh, but overall, what we work really hard at at private property is crafting the web experience. We think property and browsing for property should be an awesome experience, not a difficult one, not yeah. a painful one. Uh, so we put a lot of effort into the website that you see. Yeah. Uh, if you're on any device, uh, you can use it. So smartphones, tablets, wow. laptops. Uh, and if you're really a property addict, you can download our app and have it with you wherever you are. I love it. I love it. Convenience is key. So for anyone looking to get into the property market, what would you say is the very first step they need to take? Well, I mean, you started off saying knowledge is power, yes. and uh, researching your local market is so important. A lot of people get quite emotional about the area that they live in or the home that they live in, mm -hmm. but when you're looking for your next property, you absolutely have to research the local market, understand who are the right agents to use, uh, what are the property values looking like in a particular area, what type of uh, properties should you look for and which ones should you look out yeah. not to buy. So a lot of research is important and that's why websites and tools like ours are very, very valuable uh, for people that are getting into the market. I love it. So you're taking the dauntingness out of the actual process of buying a house. Yeah, I think what we really intend to do is just make a lot of this information visible to people, whether it's through advice or forums or you know expert Q&A or, or just spending time on the site looking at various houses that are for sale. It just helps you build a sense of what to do and what not to do. I love that but before we go what if you're looking to sell property what would your approach be then? Well, marketing your property is actually easy. You know, there's so many options, uh, but the one thing you have to remember is how many people are online these days. Yeah. Uh, it's the first port of call when people are looking to buy. In fact, over 90% of people start their search for property wow, online. So, true. so if you're looking to sell, uh, you want to market through an agent or you want to market yourself, you absolutely have to be on a website like ours. Wonderful. Oh, Simon, like already the nervousness that I felt about the whole situation is gone. You have really, really explained it really well. So thank you. And I'm glad you're going to be here every Friday. That'll be excellent. Do you have a tip of the day when it comes to selling or buying property for us? Well, if we're going to wrap everything up, yes. um, remember 90% of potential buyers start their search online, mm -hmm. so make an effort to list your property online uh, and it can only be a successful sale. Boom, there we have it. Thank you so much. Thank Wonderful. You. Oh, I love this. Now, when you know how to use something and how to get the most out of it, it simply shuts out all of the confusion. Be wise when it comes to buying or selling properties. You can do so by visiting www.privateproperty.co.za, the trusted property people.